gonna do. You're gonna make me spill my tea. I know, I know. I've had to buy a bomb bag. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well. Hey everyone, me again. Welcome back to Rex Media Rex and our first daily vlog. How exciting. It is currently Tuesday, <laughs> what is the date? Tuesday the 13th of August today um, and I'm tired, very very tired. I've woken up and I could sleep for hours. Oh my goodness. Um, but I'm in a good mood today so we're just gonna crack on. I've got loads of filming to do today. I'm gonna hopefully be filming three videos. I've started a new thing where I tend to film all my videos on one day and then edit them over the next few days. Um, just because once I've filmed one, I feel like I'm in the mood for it. Like I really have to build myself up to actually set things up and then film. And then once I've done it, I'm like, oh, okay, that wasn't that bad. <laughs> I could do more. Um, so it just kind of makes sense then. And then the, like the next day I can sit in my pajamas, I don't have to put makeup on and just edit them all in um, a big batch so that's a little insider tip there for being a full-time youtuber and um, i used the most amazing face uh, hair mask last night oh it's my hair feels incredible it's by windle london i don't think i think you can buy it online but you have to buy it direct from them they're like a salon in london and they sent me this hair mask and oh my god it is amazing i love it because i ran out of my deep repair macadamia one quite a while ago I just forgot how nice it is to have a hair mask on. I left it on for like 10 minutes and just, oof, it's, my hair feels very nice. Anyway, <laughs> I digress. I'm gonna make a cup of tea um, and then go on and answer all my Instagram comments, all my YouTube comments and sort my inbox out. That is the plan, let's go. So it's currently half past 12 and I'm gonna get myself some lunch because I'm really hungry. Finally finished all the admin stuff. It's such a boring morning. I have to go through all like the invoices and um, emails and comments and stuff. It's just one of those kind of like attached to your laptop kind of things. It doesn't really take too much brain power but takes a lot of time. Um, so I don't know what I'm gonna have for lunch. I think I'm just gonna raid the fridge, see what we've got in. We're still having our Gusto boxes. At Absolutely loving them. In fact, I've got the vlog going live tonight. Um, so I'm a little bit behind with this vlog, future me, blah, blah, blah. Uh, so hopefully you guys like that. But we've got fajitas tonight for tea, which I'm really excited about. And for lunch, I just tend to see what's in the fridge. There's lots of eggs, so I tend to have like um, scrambled eggs, maybe some prawn mayonnaise, maybe some veggies, some hummus, that kind of stuff. So yeah, always looks weird, my lunch plate. <laughs> There is literally nowhere to put this camera where it's a good angle here. So we're just gonna have to go with this one. Um, I had my shower and now I'm gonna get ready because I've got three videos to film today. I'm gonna film my top 10 favorite gins video because I know that a lot of you guys love gin as well. Um, I'm gonna be filming a curvy gin wear haul and also a wisdom strips teeth review because you guys have been going mad for those strips on Instagram since I did the collaboration with them they're just so good and i've got a spare set so i thought i'd do a dedicated review video it's not paid or anything they haven't asked me to do it um but i really love the product i've been so impressed by it and you guys have been liking it as well i get sent so many um pictures on instagram of you you lot who have bought it and go look here's my teeth afterwards thank you so much i can't believe how well they worked so i kind of figured that it makes sense for them to have their own video so that's pretty much the plan for today so I've got to get my filming face on um, and do something with this. I'm looking so pale. I really need fake tan, but it is what it is. <laughs> I haven't fake tan today, so we've got to deal with it. Let me try and turn this light down a little bit. No, none of it helps. None of it helps. Right. Um, so, little get ready with me, I suppose. That's the one good thing about these daily vlogs that we try and adjust you. Without breaking it. Can't get it any higher. That's the one good thing about these daily vlogs is that 
um, I get to fill them with more content because I don't have to like just give you snippets of the entire week so I'm quite liking this new design um, so moisturizer at the moment I'm using a few actually a few of the pixie ones that I love but today I'm going to go for the neon great day glow now this isn't actually out yet I think this is out on the 1st of September but oh man it's so good I've luckily been able to try it out first very very privileged over here it just smells incredible it smells like a spa and it's 30 SPF yeah 30 SPF which is amazing it goes on so nicely my skin seems to love it touch wood my skin is actually pretty good at the moment for me anyway and uh, I think we have Neom and Pixie to thank for that. Okay, so gonna put some foundation on to try and even things out. I'm not gonna put too much makeup on today because Chris and I are actually going trampolining later. <laughs> so I kind of feel that sweaty face makeup and trampolining isn't gonna go down too well. Um, this is the Match Perfection Rimmel uh, in Fair Beige because I think this is the one that matches me when I don't have a tan, so let's have a look. It's not like the palest foundation I've got, because I've still got a tiny bit of colour, but it's not really tanned in any way, so this should work. If not, I'll mix in something else. I think that's about right, you know? It's depressing. <laughs> um, blend with the Beauty Blender. Are beauty blenders ever not going to be a thing? Because they're just so good, aren't they? They kind of revolutionise stuff. Starting to get really dry lips again. When I get, like, run down, I've been quite poorly the last um, week and a half, maybe. Like, when I got back from Scotland, I've been really poorly. And whenever I get really run down and poorly, my lips get so dry in the corners. Does anybody else get it where they crack because they're that dry? So I'm like desperately putting on as much uh, lip balm as I can. This is the Lana Lips Golden Ointment and it's so nice. Really thick. Eyebrows, which need dyeing quite badly actually. They need tinting. I might do that later. Problem is you can't tint when you fake tan and I when I like sit down, I kind of like do everything at once. So then my eyebrows get neglected but I'm gonna use Benefit Browsings I'm trying to think which video to film first I think I might film the teeth whitening one first then the gins then the gym wear haul because haul videos are an absolute bugger to film they take so long especially when you're trying everything on That'll do. Okay, um, everyday eyeshadow, I tend to use this bourgeois one pot thing. It's number 54, it doesn't have a name. It's just like a really lovely warm brown. But it just kind of, I don't know, it's just easy. You just kind of put it all over the lid and you're sort of done. It gives you this lovely warm smoky eye. Um, that I think goes really well with blue eyes actually warm colours like oranges, warm browns tend to really make eyes pop. There you go. Um, eyeliner, definitely going to put some of that on today. Oh, I'm so thirsty. I've not drunk enough water today. Eyeliner I'm using Benefit Roll Lash. They're a bit wonky today. Oh. 
Um, True Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. I absolutely love this stuff. It's really great for volume. And we need some bronzer of some kind. So I'm going to go for Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer. It's one of my faves. I've hit pan on this so long ago. Really need to buy a new one. Stick this everywhere and then we'll blend it in afterwards. <laughs> That's the plan anyway. Just shove it on your face and sort it out afterwards. I'm just get my foundation brush and kind of blend in the edges, go over anywhere that may have been a bit too heavy handed. do a good job at pretending like I know what I'm talking about I think a um, bit of benefit hula just to help define a little bit bit of contour eh that'll do and then I'm going to go for a benefit gold rush on my cheeks today something a little bit different instead of my NARS palette because I always use that Oh, lovely, that'll do. Gwen Stefani, girlfriend with Urban Decay. Don't think this is available anymore. I've nearly run out. I'm sad. It's such a nice nude. Isn't it so nice? Oh, I love it. And some Me Cosmetics highlighter, I think. And then we're done. Spray a bit of the Pixie Rose Glow Mist, which I just like, and my face likes. And that's it, that is my makeup done. Need to do something with my hair now. <laughs> I think I'm just going to straighten it for the first video, uh, then maybe pin it back for the second one, and then curl it for the third one. And then it looks like we're doing it all on different days. <laughs> Okay, I'm ready to film. Let's do this. Two videos down, one to go. Got interrupted by the postman halfway through one of them, which is really annoying. It was mid-sentence and I had to re-record a load of stuff again. And now I've got all the gin on my living room floor. So um, I'm gonna go and make myself a cup of tea, have a little bit of a break so I can rest my voice, um, and then settle in for the gym wear haul, which is gonna take the longest. So I'm gonna charge this battery up and uh, move some furniture around and get cracking with that. I've stolen some of Chris's protein powder today um, because I normally have vegan protein powder. Um, as the way sometimes really affects me uh, but I realised that I've been having um, obviously my like carb crushers if you see me on Instagram raving about them I love them um, my little protein bars and they've got whey protein in so I feel like my body might be okay and I realised that the last time I had a whey protein smoothie was uh, back in 2013 when I just had my bout of gastroenteritis and my uh, dairy intolerance was really bad. So I'm hoping, I'm trying it today, I'm going to give it a go and I'm hoping that then normal protein powder will be okay for me moving forward because the vegan stuff is really hard to get hold of um, and the vanilla plain stuff tastes horrible the only one i found that tastes good is like a chocolate one and i don't always fancy a chocolate shake so yeah fingers crossed i don't blow up like a balloon and uh <laughs> chris doesn't notice that i've stolen some of his protein i am a sweaty mess after filming that video and that is the carnage of um a gym wear try on haul now i remember why i film these down in the basement because it's so much cooler down there I am like I don't feel like I need to go to the gym today I'm absolutely knackered just filming that anyway all three videos are now done how cute is this set from my protein oh I just love it I never want to take it off um but yeah you'll find those coming up on the channel very very soon so keep your eyes peeled and now I'm gonna go and collect a parcel it's 10 to 5 so I'm gonna go and collect a parcel that I ordered the other day um from ASOS it's a little bum bag <laughs> 
<laughs> I know, I know, I've had to buy a bum bag. Um, but just for when we're walking Toby, because I often go out in like my gym wear, for example, and there's no pockets for poo bags or your keys or my phone or my camera. Um, so I thought I'd buy a little bum bag that you can also wear over your shoulder. Um, and it'll be good for dog walks and it was like seven quid or something and free delivery if you have it delivered to asda so i'm going to walk over there get some steps in and go and collect that this is my snazzy new bum bag ladies and gentlemen it's actually bigger than i thought this is going to be really useful because i think i can put a little um water bottle in there as well so yeah there you go 31 years old and i've officially bought a bum bag all because of you it's not yours, it's still mine. Is it cool to wear it like this? I'm not really sure. I kind of think that's what it's for, you know? Oh, I'm so uncool. It's definitely not a bum bag, actually, because it doesn't go around your waist. There's nothing to, like, clip on, clip off. So maybe it does just kind of, like, hang like this. I don't know. Either way, it's going to be useful. have just had gusto fajitas for tea and they were actually delicious different to our normal old el paso ones um and a lot less calories as well um so we're actually going to go trampolining this evening is something different to do i was supposed to be going to the cinema with my friend lizzie but she completely forgot <laughs> So I was like, right, I want to do something and we've been meaning to go trampolining for ages. So we're going to go to flip out and uh, flip out. Hope I don't break my neck. And I can use my new sling bag. That's what it's called. I had to Google it. Very useful. Well, we weren't allowed to film inside there, um, but take it from us. We had a fantastic time until Muggins here rolled her ankles. <laughs> so I'm not, minutes from the end? <laughs> like four minutes from the end. I was doing somersaults, absolutely smashing it, and then rolled my ankle right at the very last minute. So yeah, I'm pretty good about that. So we're going home <laughs> to ice it in the hope that I can still go to badminton tomorrow. And we've got an inflatable um, assault course to do on Sunday, which is kind of why we came here to like have a little bit of a practice. And if I can't go to that, I'll be gutted. So uh, stay tuned for updates on Instagram. <laughs> Don't laugh. Oh dear. <laughs> well, what a turn of events for this evening. So I thought I was suggesting something fun to do, get a bit of exercise in, do something a little bit different. Ended up with a mildly sprained ankle. Fantastic. Anyway, um, I'm going to leave the vlog here. We're going to finish watching um, an episode of The Boys on Amazon Prime, is it? Mm -hmm. Is that what it's called? The Boys? Yeah, it is. Keep yeah. wanting to say bad boys, but it's not bad boys. Um, uh, which is, uh, Toby, you're going to make me spill my tea. I'm oh my goodness me. It's called The Boys and it's about um, superheroes. It's very, it's, it's similar to Umbrella Academy on Netflix, um, but about the goodies being actually baddies. And yeah, it's really, really good. If you haven't seen it, definitely tune in and watch. Um, but I hope you enjoyed this first daily vlog. It's been an eventful one, definitely. Um, leave me a comment down below. And if you are new, of course, click that subscribe button. But as always, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next week. Bye. Just another excuse to go back and eat more cake. Oh, I've got a little blister on my foot. There you go, that's the solution. <laughs>
me again welcome back to Wix and Weenie Rex I 